ahorita vamos a tirar esta es una esto sea 16 150 pero la pipa está hecha a huevo está pachurrada de arriba y de abajo como aquí pueden ver la altura tiene como un, un cuarto un cuarto arriba a los lados está bien a los lados se encuentra bien the welder uh, Chris right here bought up the fit he's a uh, 532 gap 332 wire to put a penetrated tack on the top. Every time you fit, you want to start with the tack on the top and then take the spacer, take the spacer out and then tack the bottom. Uh, the most important thing when fitting up a flange is making sure your two holes, your two holes are leveled. That way um, it doesn't, it doesn't uh, mess up when they try to bolt it up. Uh, But yeah, guys, he's running about a hundred, hundred eleven amps for his penetrated tack, and then you want to level the flange also before you tack the bottom. And uh, most people they use a jack stand to hold the flange up. But sometimes uh, they'll use the crane if it's also like too heavy, just in case the tack breaks. So he had to transition the inside a little bit. That way the the pipe is flush not no high low you know what i mean sometimes the pipe sometimes the pipe doesn't fit correctly it'll come out like an oval shape but you just got to trust in the fitter that with his experience it can give you a good fit even though the pipe is kind of warped and uh it'll make the welder's job a whole lot easier all right guys once you get the tacks top and bottom and the flange is leveled uh vertically you want to check the horizontal with a square and a tape measure it should read uh the same the same distance from there to the same distance from here and if if it doesn't read the same you just tweak it with a little screwdriver a flathead open it up to where whatever side it needs to open up to and then you do the same process again and check you want you want to make sure you have your square in the center of the flange and touching the flange face. Sometimes people use a longer, a longer flange, a longer square, but uh, usually with this, it's, it's enough. Okay, just to subtract your, your gap, take off, it really is gonna depend on your, on your texture of your pipe. And in this case, for a standard pipe, it's going to be 116. Take off. Okay? This case is a uh, foot, 10 and a 16. Supposed to be 10, 10 uh, 9 foot 10, uh, exactly. But we just left a 16, which is going to reduce whenever it's been into well. It's going to reduce uh, 116. All right.